Let's look at some tips to conduct participant observations in qualitative research. Conducting field observations is one of the most effective ways of collecting data in qualitative research. Conducting observations includes noting phenomena in the field setting to the use of five senses of the observer such as sound, sight, smell, touch, and taste. The researcher also uses a note-taking instrument to record the observations for researcher purposes. The purpose of research and research questions will be the main determinants of the observation made by a researcher. When conducting observations, a researcher should therefore watch the participants, the physical setting, the interactions, activities, conversations, and their own behaviors during the observation. During observations, researchers should be aware that writing down everything is nearly impossible. So, when conducting an observation, a researcher should start with a broad focus and then narrow down to observations that relate to their research questions or purpose. During observations, the observer will be involved in what they are observing to a certain extent. The extent to which an observer is engaged in making observations will determine the observation type they are engaged in. There are four observation types including complete participant, participating observer, non-participant observer, and complete observer. Let's look at complete participant. Such an observer will be fully engaged with the people they are observing. This may help the observer to establish a better rapport with the people they observe. Now let's look at the participating observer. This will include a participant who is also an observer. In such a setting, the participant role will be more prominent than the researcher role. By being a participant, a researcher may therefore be able to obtain subjective data and insider views. However, when serving as a participant observer, a researcher may find it difficult to record data when they are engaged in activities. Now, let's look at the non-participant observer. In this scenario, the researcher is an outsider of a given group that they are studying. The researcher will therefore watch the group under investigation and take their field notes without interfering with the group activities. Let's look at the complete observer. In the scenario of a complete observer, the researcher is neither noticed nor seen by the people they are studying. However, in most cases, the role of the researcher may change during an observation. For example, a researcher can begin as a non-participant observer and then move into a participating role and vice versa. The role of the researcher may therefore exist in a continuum during the research process, which can allow the researchers to move from being complete outsiders to being complete insiders. Let me interrupt this video for a minute and inform you of my services. My first type of service that I offer is consulting for anything related to qualitative data analysis using NVIVO. You hop on a video call with me through Microsoft Teams or Zoom and I will help you become a pro with NVIVO in a few hours. I also provide a done for you data analysis service. I do the manual coding and provide a data analysis report with the necessary visuals. Some kind of visuals I do include tables, hierarchy charts, and the framework matrix. Email or message me right now. Details in the description. When conducting observations, the researcher will need to be aware of issues such as 1. Impression management 2. Potential deception of the people being observed and three, being marginalized in strange observation settings. Now, here are some tips that researchers should follow during observations. Tip number one, selecting the ideal sites to make observations and obtaining all the necessary permissions to access such sites. Tip number two, after gaining access to the site, the observer should note down what to observe, who to observe, the time of day to make observations, and the length of observations. In some instances, an observer can rely on a gatekeeper to assist them in accessing the observation group. Tip number three, determine the different types of observation that will be taken. For example, an observer being a complete participant on one side of the continent or being a complete observer on the other side of the continent. Tip number four, develop and use an observation protocol that can be used to record notes in the field. Therefore, a researcher should ensure that the observation protocol is well marked with the date, place, and type of observation. Tip number five, take time to build initial rapport with the individuals being observed or have a person who is known to the group to introduce the observer. An observer can also begin with limited objectives during the first few sessions of observation. In this regard, 
the researcher can focus on observing more and taking fewer notes during the initial observation session. Number six, keep detailed records during observations such as the physical setting, the portraits of the participants, particular activities and events, and an observer's reactions. An observer should also provide clear descriptions of what happened during observations and also provide insights, personal reflections, initial interpretations, and breakthroughs. Tip number seven, follow good observation procedures. Now, after making observations, an observer should withdraw from the site and thank the participants while also updating the participants on how they are going to use the data collected and the ability of the participants to access the study results. Tip number eight, prepare sufficient notes after observations. After going through an observation, an observer should take time to prepare notes and have rich narrative descriptions. Such notes should provide the full descriptions of the people in a given observed setting and the events under observation. Remember, I provide done-for-you data analysis services and consulting services for any problem or challenge related to NVivo. So check the link and email in the description and talk to me right away. Thank you.